Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilith Huting, and I'm here with Pixel Chi at the Consumer Electronics Show, and we're looking at a couple of their different screens. They have a 7-inch screen with a 1024 by 600 pixel display, and uh, two 10-inch screens, one with 1024 by 600, which has been around for a little while, and a new 1280 by 800 that they're showing off. And what makes these screens special is that they are sunlight-readable displays um, that use significantly less power than a regular LCD screen, even though they are LCD technology, when you turn off the backlight. So let's take a look and see what happens here when we change the backlight modes here. It's full brightness, it's minimum brightness, and that's completely off. Okay, and so even completely off, there is some color. Uh, you're going to see it more under certain lighting conditions than others. It's not quite black and white, but it sort of looks black and white. When you go to minimal brightness, you definitely get a lot of color. Um, and then when you go to full brightness, it looks like you know, any other LCD display. Um, now you guys have also done some work, I think, to uh, improve the viewing angles. So when you view from yes, the much, sides, much wider viewing angles, you should be able to um, to still see the color without it washing out. If you go too far, it does start to wash out. It's, it's actually, there, yeah, it's actually um, better than many of the LCDs that you can buy at Best Buy for oh, yeah, it's, viewing angles. It's not a pixel tree unique problem. So it's something no, 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 that's good no, no, to know no, no. that you've been working on. So yeah, this this that. this particular unit is a is a sample. This is uh, just retrofitted into an existing product from Villa of a company that no longer exists. Right. Um, we also have a number of different samples in different sizes over here, um, and a couple of products that you can actually purchase right now, including the Soul Computer Windows 7 tablet, and uh, this is a tablet with a 10-inch, uh, uh, this is the 1024 by 600 pixel right. version, I think, uh, touch layer on top of it. Uh, this is an engineering sample that we're looking at here, which has, instead of the glossy screen that we see here, has more of a matte display and can be sort of used as an e-reader. It's actually using an infrared touch. Okay. So there's no glass on top of our screen at all. There's an infrared wash over it, which is why you can use two finger and make it you know, smaller and bigger. But it's actually, it's a very, very good paper uh, like look. And can, can we, uh, can you turn off the screen on this, or the backlight on this, or is that? We can sign an NDA, are you? Uh, yes, I just can't remember where. <laughs> I, I can't remember where to do it on this one. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. Um, and then, take a, take a quick look over here. Uh, something else, this is probably not going to come across very well on the video, but um, there are different layers of glass and uh, touch technology and so forth that you can put on top of the Pixel Sheet screen, and you're going to have different sort of impacts depending on how that's done. So right. what we have here is a number of different types of glass that can sort of, uh, I think you were saying the diffusion. Is yeah, different. well you get a lot of, sometimes depending on how uh, the glass is constructed on top of our display panel, it has very, it can have you know, either no impact on front of screen or it can have uh, a visual impact on some of these. You can see a little bit of a shimmer. Um, it probably isn't coming out. This one has quite a lot of a, what's called speckle. Um, and so this is really here to adv um, advise you know, companies who are really well along in, in doing uh, their implementation you know, of, of what specific things they can do that, that uh, still preserve a delightful front of screen performance and other things that don't work quite as well, even though the glass by itself looks gorgeous. Okay. And then uh, just to sum up, uh, Pixel Sheet has been showing off the technology for a couple of uh, years now. There aren't a lot of commercially available products, uh, but you guys have been selling a, a fair number to uh, military uh, customers who, you know, people, as you were saying, parachute out of a plane and need to be able to see exactly where they are on their tablet right away with a GPS unit or something else. And you're also uh, working with automotive industry for uh, trucks, tractors, other uh, military vehicles and so forth, where sunlight readable uh, display in certain environments is a must have. So, um, you know, hopefully as, as production picks up and as these uh, screens are out there for other companies to use, we might start to see more commercial tablets or notebooks or other devices. But for right now, um, three different screen sizes available, possibly more in the future. And this is uh, Pixel 2 with their sunlight readable displays at CES 2011.